When you're talking about facial cosmetic surgery, one of the most important things to me is to strive for that natural result, for a result that makes a patient look rested without overdone. We've all seen those patients walking down the street or in the shopping malls where they're pulled so tight that their mouth is coming up to their ears. Well, that's not what we're going for with facial cosmetic surgery. When we're doing a facelift, there are many different things that we can do to a patient's face. We can do little mini facelifts, which are better for younger patients, which just give us a little bit of rejuvenation, pull up the jowl area, tighten up the neck area without a really big deal. We could do a complete facelift. We're addressing the eyebrows, the middle face, as well as the lower aspect of the face as well. Most importantly, individualize this procedure. Everybody's needs and everybody's face is very different. But obtaining that natural result is something that we can do and I do strive for in every patient. Now we can often combine a facelift, whether it's a mini facelift, an upper facelift, or a lower facelift, along with doing an eyelid lift at the same time. That gives us total facial rejuvenation and often takes years off a patient's facial appearance. Now these are done in the office ambulatory center with my board certified anesthesiologist and recovery time for a facelift is about a week or so and I lift about five or six days. It's really a nice thing to combine both the facial cosmetic surgery with the eye lift to give a very nice rejuvenation and a natural rested look.